Yeah, the liberal arts, things like literature, uh, history, philosophy, and uh, historical theology, it's the bringing together all of the aspects of basically the, the thought life of a particular culture. Um, and so it's not as if it's not as if science doesn't impact culture. Clearly, it does. But ideas have impacted culture in ways that we tend to either misunderstand or we tend to miss because we tend not to realize that we all swim in a particular water and we tend to drink those waters. Right? The fish doesn't know that it's wet. <laughs> um, and so the liberal arts seek to look at all of these ideas and the different ways that they've been handed down to us, the different ways people have conceived of the good, the true, the beautiful, uh, and, they, and they seek to both examine where these come from in certain cases, and then also what have been the consequences of some of these ideas, and how does a particular, for instance, in literature, how does a particular genre or a particular author capture these ideas and put it into a story such that we can understand a bit more um, both about not only the author himself, but about the characters that he's created. We're doing the four, uh, uh, history and literature uh, and uh, philosophy and historical theology. And we've taken those as the, the four bases of the Christian liberal arts education. 